40, 90.7. This is Dennis Elsis. It's WFUV. Dennis Elsis has worked behind a microphone for 40 years. Yet I don't think that I ever imagined that it could be a career. It's Bruce Springsteen from the latest album, Down. Elsis started small at his Queens College radio station before moving on to a part-time radio job in Westchester County. I don't know that I ever really decided it. I mean, I loved radio. And I grew up in the 60s listening to the rock and roll radio and, you know, all the great music that was coming at that time. Here's then, Elsa's got from, what he calls uh, the opportunity of a lifetime, so and one that would make me. him famous. And lo and behold, by the early 70s, I had joined what would be the most important FM station in New York, I think, which was WNEW-FM. There, as a music director, Dennis got the chance to interview one of his idols. John Lennon is still for me the one, you know, because because I was such a Beatle fan, you know, because in 1964, I'm a kid listening to the Ed Sullivan show. And 10 years later, I'm in a studio talking to John Lennon about his brand new album, Walls and Bridges. And it becomes a pretty famous interview. And it goes, Why don't you just say hello? Surprise, surprise. It's <laughs> Dr. Winston O'Boogie at your service. <laughs> I am Dennis's surprise. Actually. He's relaxed and thank goodness. I guess I was relaxed because it sounds that way, although I can tell you how nervous I was. Elsus also interviewed the likes of Elton John and Mick Jagger in his 25 years at WNEW. He was let go when the station ditched rock and roll for a talk radio format. And I could see not only the handwriting on the wall, <laughs> we were all fired. <laughs> so, you know, these, these are the things that happened. But, but Dennis then found his way to Fordham's own WFUV, where he's been mixing it up for 14 years. And so in the summer of 2000, there was an opening, and I interviewed with the folks here, and I guess they were willing to take a chance on me, and I thought, well, this will be nice for a summer. And now it's 14 years later. That's the name of the song here at WFUV. You know, it's, it's great. And one minute playing the Arctic Monkeys and the next minute playing the Beatles, that's, that's kind of cool. A kind of cool he shares with his listeners every weekday from 2 to 6 p.m. I loved radio. I loved rock and roll. And I don't think I ever imagined that I'd still be doing it today. Kelly Coltis for Ion Fordham. Faith in the autumn defense and Dennis Elsis and WFUV.